Hello everyone, welcome to QAB Box. So in our session today we are going to see what is the difference between WebDriver.FindElement and WebElement.FindElement. So we all know about the locator strategy and how we are going to uh, locate an element or perform certain action on an element right like to identify an element we use the find element method so normally in a like very basic uh, way if I want to do then I will just say that driver dot find element driver dot find element and then here I will be giving any of the locator strategy let's say that by ID and then I can perform like click send keys whatever option I want to do I can do those things right so we always seen that we are using with uh, I mean driver with find element only but do you guys know that there is another uh, way that we can do even we can use the web element as well okay so driver is nothing but a web driver object right so web driver is an interface the same thing web element is also an interface but then selenium gives this find element method in both web driver and also in web element class as well sorry into the interface as well so now let's see that what is the difference between this driver dot find element and web element dot find element so for this what i'm going to do i'll take this particular uh, demo application as an example so as you can see here there is a list items so like if you see this is basically like a one two three four all four uh, list items are there and then if you see on this first item there is a sub list item is there Okay, so which will help us to identify the difference between driver dot find element and web element dot find element and I will be showing you what is the syntax and what is the outcome of that. Okay, so for this let's first go to the inspect and once you go to the inspect let's try to find it out all the least items the li tags for this I'm going to use the selectors hub so that I don't need to do any kind of coding uh, first let me just identify if I just do li and then press enter you can see there are five items that is matching so you can see one two three four and also there is a sub list which is also a list if I go to this you can see under this list one there is a ul and under this there is another list item okay so that's why it identified five now what is this now if I go to my code base and try to do the same thing like if I say here let's say that a web element uh, let's make it as a list of web element because I'm getting number of uh, elements right it's not single element so list of web element and I will just say items maybe I will say that items equal to driver dot find elements because I want to capture the multiple elements and here I will say by by tag name and then here I will be putting it as li okay li now this will be just capturing the number of web elements now if I print this size right like items dot size okay let's see what happens to this one I'll just make a wait and then I will close this driver okay and run this test and let's see that how many items really it is displaying there we have seen with the selectors of the HTML dome right but I wanted to show you guys what exactly it will display when we are doing driver dot find elements let's see there is some error it is coming okay it seems like the driver executable is not present not a problem I will make it as quickly And then rerun okay so as you can see the size is returning as 5 and the same thing also we have got with our selector sub also that five elements are matching so now what is this driver dot find elements what exactly this driver does actually now if you see this driver is basically trying to find it out the matching criteria that is whatever the locator strategy we are using across on the entire web page actually irrespective of uh, whether it is parent child or whatever it is there it is just going through each of the parent and the child elements and trying to search but this is very limited to this particular page only not to this application because if I go to this uh, the home page and if I say by tag name li I will be getting a different result actually altogether so 
it means that the driver dot find element does the search with the matching criteria on the current page or on the current screen there is an exception though so the exception is that it will skip the iframes and also the shadow root elements because for those particular specialized groups or the different ways of portraying the elements driver will not be able to reach inside that you need to either switch to the frame or you need to make a certain changes to your shadow root which we already discussed now let's talk about what is web element dot find element so for this what i'm going to do i'll just comment this one okay so here let me just comment this one and after this here i will be making another one now let's say i'm taking an element that is any kind of web element and i will say that element dot find elements and then we will see what is the difference it makes for an instance let's say that see this is also one web element right you can see the id is a subgroup now let me do one thing i'll make it as a web element and i will say element equal to driver dot find element i'm just taking a reference and i will say by id and here i will say that a subgroup okay that i'm taking as a reference now let's say i want to take the same concept which i have used before like let me just copy paste this one and here after copy pasting instead of a driver i will be taking this element this element means which one this subgroup actually if you go to this application you can see this is my subgroup okay now let's say that see i'm taking the same thing find elements by tag name li find elements dot uh, of by tag name li now let's see what is the difference it makes what is the size of li i'm getting here and as you can see surprisingly it is giving me one not the five see everything is same right by tag name li here also but here the big difference is that i'm taking as element not the web driver it means that when i'm taking this particular element as my reference and then dot find element by id uh, by tag name li it will not search through the entire web page of this current web page what it does it will just search inside this particular element how many elements are matching to that so when i'm taking this as a reference and i'm searching that this element dot find element by tag name li after this there is only one li you can see that is why it returned me only one element so this is the biggest difference between your driver dot find element and web element dot find element so when you are saying web element dot find element that web element will become your the reference point and all the child elements whatever it is present inside that it will search for the matching criteria not on the entire web page it means that when i'm saying element dot find element it will not go beyond this particular element like it won't search through this paragraphs and then this body head and form all these things no not really it will take that element as a reference and all of these child elements everything it will be searching and finding the matched criteria in this case there is only one element matched so that's why we have got the output as only one okay so this could be one of the interview question to you guys like what are the cases where driver dot find element is really working fine so you can say that current web page but then accept your iframe and shadow root whereas web element dot find element always searches the matched criteria inside that particular element only if any child elements are present very simple and straightforward but very important when you are going for an interview okay so hope this particular session is useful uh, do subscribe and stay tuned to this youtube channel thank you for watching